What up guys, Ryan Irwin here with you. Just wanted to give you some training footage and an update. Um, this is the first Saturday after my meet last weekend. And I threw a video up on my meet, so a lot of this is uh, you you can see in, on the, um, the video. But overall, I was extremely happy with the meet. Um, my best meet ever, probably. Uh, came out with PRs, <coughs> hit 9 for 9 around my lifts, and just, just felt good. Just a real good meet. It was a long meet. Um, didn't get done lifting until 8 p.m., but uh, aside from that, everything else went really good. Uh, squats, um, hit a PR of 11 pounds. Need to focus on staying tight up at the top. Um, I think that's my key. Had plenty of strength coming out of the hole. Of course, I was wearing knee wraps. So right now I'm doing a volume training cycle and uh, staying with uh, knee sleeves just to help continue to strengthen my legs. So uh, I'm going to do that and then I'll do wraps again after, uh, after this volume cycle. So um, the squats, again, I think I just need to focus on staying tight um, and focus on my upper body. One of the things that I've been doing to accomplish that is uh, I've added good mornings in. Uh, and also I'm going to continue to do front squats on my Thursday leg days uh, Increasing the volume a little bit on those. So they definitely got me this week um, I, I uh, had soreness in many areas including my uh, abdominal wall And also in my hamstrings which I attribute that to the good mornings So uh, bench felt really good. I was really pleased with that actually Almost felt too good. My third attempt, I hit 308, and that was, um, and that was 11, no, 16 pound increase over the last meet. It really felt very easy, so I kind of undershot that. But you know, you, you walk away with a with an increase like that, uh, 16 pounds. You can't you can't be upset about that. So um, looking to uh, continue to work on that and uh, just get stronger there, uh, get more confidence in my bench. Uh, my shoulder, I think, is pretty much back to normal, so I'm pleased with that. I'm hoping on my next meet, which I'm planning for in November, to hit uh, 2, 214, uh, or I'm sorry, 314, 320, somewhere in that area, which would be an all-time PR for me. Deadlifts, I uh, was extremely happy with deadlifts. Um, I opened up with 495, which to me, I was just like, wow, that, I remember a time that was my third attempt, so kind of surreal in that regard, um, but I continue to focus on uh, just getting stronger there, uh, breathing rack pulls, which you're going to see here in a second, uh, I think is a big part of that. So this was uh, my last set, I did seven sets here, and this was my seventh set, do as many as possible. Did not feel the best today, um, I think I'm fighting off a cold or something, had a lot of head pressure, um, was hoping to get ten or more on this, only got eight. Um, but you know what, it's, uh, it's as many as possible, and uh, that's what was possible today. So I didn't want to kill myself. I felt like I put in some good effort here. Um, at the same time, I could tell that uh, 10 wasn't going to happen today, which I was fine with. So uh, I, I've got an increase in volume over the last time I did this cycle. Um, so that's, that, to me, is, is the big key there. So, um, but, you know, the, again, going back to deadlifts, um, the breathing rack pulls, I think, has been a big help. Just continue to focus on uh, getting stronger there. I felt more explosive out of the hole, which, um, A, just thinking about it, and then also B, the deadlift, the deficit deadlifts. Um, here, this is a stiff bar. So I'm still working with 85% um, of my max on a deadlift bar. So um, you know I'm trying not to let the bar affect my weight. So these weren't easy by any stretch, but um, got them done. So you can see me making sure I don't pass out there. So again, uh, a lot of head pressure today. So um, yesterday's bench session was a little less than uh, uh, expected, but. I'm um, probably fighting some sort of cold, and I, I felt that today as well. So, um, under breathing rack pulls, I'm doing something a little different here, uh, suggested from a friend of mine, Dan Conant. Uh, instead of been doing the, the 20 rep scheme, which I do as many as I can, um, I did 225 for a minute, pulled off 16 reps, and then I jumped up to 315. Uh, I did a set of five here, again, taking a deep breath at the top, going just below my knees. 
um, and then on my next set I'm going to go to 4 or 5 and do the same. So I'm thinking I'm going to make some progress here. I might see how many breaths I could take on my last set. Um, here on my next uh, set I did 4 or 5. I took I think 2 or 3 good breaths in so I'm going to try to increase that for next time. And then for my next train block, when I go into the strength, I think I'll do an overload here and just try to do a single with uh, additional weight and progress that way. But I really like these, and I think they've been a key for me. So thanks for checking in. Uh, keep training, keep following my logs. I appreciate that, and we'll keep you posted.